UN Chief Ban Ki-moon is calling for the immediate release of political leaders in the West African state of Burkina Faso. The Presidential Guard has detained the interim President and Prime Minister, as well as a number of other government officials in the capital, Ouagadougou. Well, these are pictures from outside the Presidential Palace where the politicians are being held. Earlier, soldiers reportedly fired warning shots after hundreds of protesters gathered near the building. It's feared that what's happening in Ouagadougou may be a coup staged by the elite regiment just weeks before Burkina Faso holds a general election. Interim President Michel Cafando and Prime Minister Isaac Zida came to power only last year, and that happened after a popular uprising forced the former leader, Blaise Campiore, to resign. He'd been president for 27 years. Earlier, we spoke to Emna Zina Thabe, a political analyst based in the capital. She said that TV and radio stations had been shut down. Uh, what it seems now is that um, this situation might be a coup uh, organized by uh, subaltern officers, junior officers, who are um, trying to make uh, their chief officers join them. And it seems also that the uh, Bless Compare, uh, former party, the CDP, who was in charge of the, this country for more than 20 years, um, is somehow taking advantage of the situation and uh, saying, affirming, um, that uh, this situation was not unexpected. Um, so it seems that everyone is trying uh, to take advantage, but we cannot have any clear information because the TV and radio stations have been shut down by the army uh, like two or three hours ago.